Alright guys, Tom here and welcome to a new video and today I'm doing the unboxing of the WWE Brock Lesnar Here Comes the Pain Collector's Edition Blu-ray Disc. It's just up here as I get it down here and we're going to unbox this bad boy. It's right in front of me. It's been sat here since around last week. Just really never got around to doing an unboxing like last time for the CM Punk DVD. Do check out that unboxing but today of course we're unboxing the Blu-ray collector's edition of the Brock Lesnar Here Comes the Pain Blu-ray. Now they actually did in fact re-release this as a collector's edition. Now if you don't know they did do a Brock Lesnar Here Comes the Pain DVD in 2003 as it looked like he was going to be the next big thing but sadly things didn't really turn out out that way and Brock Lesnar is in fact now back when he returned in 2012 to attack John Cena they did in fact re-release this DVD as a collector's edition and I've in fact picked myself up the blu-ray version of that collector's edition it does include six hours more of Brock Lesnar footage how can you go wrong I am the biggest Brock Lesnar fan so I want as much footage as possible of Brock Lesnar. So six hours more than the 2003 release is absolutely great. So basically this is a re-release of the DVD that they brought out in 2003. It's got the same documentary just with more footage, six hours more footage and it's on a Blu-ray version as well. Obviously in 2003 when they did the, the DVD release they didn't have Blu-ray, so I bought it on Blu-ray. This is, in fact, my first Blu-ray DVD because I only got my Blu-ray player about a few weeks ago. Never got around to actually purchasing a Blu-ray disc yet. So this is, in fact, my first Blu-ray DVD as well. So I can't imagine it looking that much better, but I, I got it anyway because it has got a special Blu-ray exclusive, apparently, and I'm actually finding it hard to get into this package. Where can we start? Can we just, like, score a hole? There we go. Just scratch it away. There we go. This is bloody hard. They've packed this pretty well. I got it from Amazon, so not from the usual place of WWEDVD.co.uk. But never mind. Let's see how it is. So, oh, they've double wrapped, actually. That's why it's so hard. Let's have a look. Ugh. They always pack it way too well. I mean, come on. It's just the DVD. Let me get into it. Right, there we go. Ugh. There we go. We're inside. Here it is. Ugh. Oh. I'm nearly in. I'm nearly in, guys. Hold on. Oh, don't want to rip anything. Here we go. The Brock Lesnar DVD. Here comes the pain. Re-release of 2003 on Blu-ray with six hours more footage. There we go. Looked pretty awesome. I've already watched this DVD about, I think it's two or three times. Really, really good documentary. I mean, I talked about how my favorite documentary was the CM Punk one. This probably comes in at second of my favorite documentary WWE has ever released. I've watched quite a lot. I've still yet to watch the Triple H one. I probably will watch that in the next few days, actually. Just reminding me I should really sit down and watch that. I only really got this because I wanted the footage of Brock Lesnar. I mean, I've already watched the documentary, so I'm un likely to watch it again for like the third time so I probably won't actually watch the documentary I mean I'm all more interested in the actual extra footage you get because I want Brock Lesnar matches all day I want to I just want to be able to pick up Brock Lesnar DVD and watch some matches of Brock Lesnar so it's great that I've got six hours more than the actual original release on this DVD and you've got a feature rare match uh, footage including OVW matches against Batista and John Cena Iron Man match against Kurt Angle 2002 King of the Ring final against Rob Van Dam 2003 Royal Rumble match and he's actually the youngest Royal Rumble winner, of course. So there, it's a two-disc set. Can we open it? There we go. Pretty freaking awesome. I'm excited for this because it's got, actually, it's got a list of all the matches if I can actually get under it. But yeah, I'm not really bothered about the documentary because I've already watched it a few times. I just really want lots of footage of Brock Lesnar and I've pretty much got that now on this DVD. So what have you got? You've got the duty title match between Brock Lesnar against Kurt Angle at uh, WrestleMania 19. Great match. One of my all-time favourite matches of, in WWE history. Never mind just a Brock Lesnar match. The WWE title match between Cena and Brock Lesnar. Backlash 2003. 60-minute Iron Man match for the WWE title against Angle and Brock Lesnar on SmackDown. Great match. Really, really like that match. Ray vs. This is Brock Lesnar on a SmackDown. WWE Championship match between Brock Lesnar and Big Show on a SmackDown. We all know what happened there. Uh, into promotional match. Goldberg versus Brock Lesnar. One of the most disappointing main events at a WrestleMania in recent history. Brock Lesnar versus Ric Flair. A no disqualification match with The Rock, Triple H, Brock Lesnar. You've got the Brock Lesnar, Kurt Angle and, and Mr. America versus Big Show, Charlie Haas and Shelton Benjamin on a SmackDown. There's a lot of SmackDown matches because Brock wasn't really around a lot um 
in 2003. I mean, he was only there for a short stint, of course. The triple threat match for the WWE title, Brock Lesnar versus Kurt Angle versus Big Show Vengeance 2003. Uh, Extreme Rules match between John Cena versus Brock Lesnar in 2012. So that's the only match they have added since Brock Lesnar has, in fact, returned. You've also got some... They're, they're, they're the ones I've just said there are the, the exclusive ones. And you've also got uh, loads of different matches of OVW, Hardy versus Lesnar, um, Rob Van Dam versus Lesnar, another great, great match. Other stuff like that, but really, the what I'm really excited just to, to have loads of copies of Brock Lesnar matches. I mean, yeah, I, I wouldn't even you'll have pretty much 90% of his matches on this DVD because he really hasn't had a lot, but that's great anyway because they're always really, really good. Glad that I finally got my hands on an actual original copy of the Brock Lesnar DVD because, of course, I watched that online. But anyway, hopefully, you enjoyed the video, guys. Thanks for watching. Hopefully, in fact, you have enjoyed this video and actually comment other DVDs you'd like me to do an unboxing of, and maybe I'll get around to doing a review of this DVD as well well because it's one of my all-time favorite documentaries and Brock Lesnar of course is my favorite superstar so here we go let's just get this in its package there we go hopefully you have in fact enjoyed this video guys thanks for watching and goodbye